I want to show you guys how to troubleshoot your disposal. Hi guys, Blair Miller here with People First Realty Group. So, since you guys love so much on how to winterize your pipes, which uh, I guess we can have some agree to disagree moments on it, I want to show you guys how to troubleshoot your disposal. So. If you are having any issues or if your disposal is just not working, I'm only gonna show you some of the very basic troubleshoot for disposals. Um, working in real estate, I've been able to fix so many of these. It's amazing how many people just don't know about a couple of things that you can do to your disposal that are so easy to fix without having to call somebody. So these are very simple things you can do before you get to calling somebody. So let's take a look. If, number one, if your disposal is just not turning on at all the first thing you want to do is make sure that you are still plugged in so this is the garbage disposal so I know that it's plugged in and I checked it earlier it's plugged in it's not working so the first thing I'm gonna do is take a look at my breaker all right so if you look at your breaker and find the designated one. So for mine, it's number four, and it's this one. So you guys can see that it is actually turned off. And you just wanna make sure that whatever, which one that it correlates to yours is turned on to make sure to see if that is what was causing the problem. All right, so if you've checked that to make sure that that's working, and it's either giving you a humming sound or it's just not turning at all, First of all, make sure that you have checked to make sure that there's anything, if there's anything in there. Um, I'm not afraid to put my hand down to disposal, but make sure it's unplugged or it's turned off and nobody's gonna mess with it. Second of all, um, if it is humming and it's just not turning or it's just not humming or making any sound, there is this tiny little button down here and this is the reset button. So if your motor is working too hard, that you put some stuff and it got heated and before it breaks it's gonna shut itself off so if it's not working and you've already reset it here's the button so there's a little red button down there it's right there so you're just gonna press it and that will reset your system now if that's still not working and sometimes <laughs> we like to put things down in the drain or in the disposal that it's not supposed to go there like potato peels or something fun and there's just something that is stuck one of the things that you can do is use this it comes with your disposal and if you don't have one it's just an allen wrench but you put it in here and just find the one that fits correctly so this will dislodge anything that you have in your disposal so as you can see I don't actually have anything in mine so it makes pretty easy turnaround now, if you have one that isn't working or not turning on or it's just humming, it could also be that you have rusted blades and that may require you free to replace it. But if you have anything that is lodged in there, this little thing is amazing. It'll save you a call to a plumber and try all these things before you have to make the call. If none of these things work, you may actually have to pay somebody to come and look at it. But if you have any questions, this is Gloria Miller of People First Realty. Have fun, guys. Have a great one.